Well, hello again, everybody. It's Brian Melville here, Remax of Santa Clarita, the eyes and ears of Santa Clarita Real Estate. Happy New Year to you. I cannot believe we are here in January 2013 already. 2012 certainly was a whirlwind and seemed to have just flown by. But thanks again for tuning in to my monthly video blog where I share with you all things Santa Clarita housing market related. And I just wanted to say one thing really quickly uh, before I begin. Uh, with 2012 being a fantastic year, uh, me and my team, the Melville team here, were able to assist 63 families into getting into some real estate, either buying or selling. And I owe that due, due in large part to many of you out here watching this video now. So just thank you very much. We are very honored and fortunate and blessed to uh, have you all as clients and friends. And uh, we're always here for you and all of your real estate needs. Um, you know, one of the reasons that I make this video blog is just to kind of keep you abreast of what is happening with the Santa Clarita housing market as it relates to inventory and a couple of the changes, uh, you know, that may affect your interest or desire to buy or sell real estate. Uh, you know, there's going to be some changes for 2013, and we had one big announcement uh, with the fiscal cliff compromise that is great news for home sellers, certainly if you're a homeowner in distress. Uh, and that being that the Mortgage Debt uh, Relief Act was extended, which means that if you were to successfully close on a short sale of your home, uh, they would not be taxing you on the amount of uh, the shortfall or the debt forgiveness. So that is just fantastic news. So for those of you who are still pondering uh, a potential short sale of your home uh, or you would just need some other advice, please feel free to get in touch with us and we'd be more than happy to answer all of those questions for you. But good news. Uh, you know, from an inventory standpoint, you guys, I think we're going to still be headed for more of the same. I mean, I pulled these numbers today and we're still feeling like the last few months of, uh, you know, my last few months of video blogs here, uh, meaning that the inventory is still below 300 homes. I mean, we, we've had three successive months where we finally, uh, you know, the number of homes sold uh, per month as it averages out over the course of a year, we were outpacing that for about nine or 10 months of last year. We are now finally slowing down and not selling uh, as many homes on a 30-day basis as we were on a monthly basis uh, for the year. So uh, with all of that said, let's jump right into the numbers and let you kind of give you, a, give you an idea of what's happening right now. Uh, as of today, when I just pulled the numbers, we have 276 homes on the market. Now, if you remove some of the outlying areas of Acton and Agua Dulce, we're only at 221 homes right here in Santa Clarita. I mean, that is not enough homes for the amount of buyer demand that we have out there. So pretty shocking. Uh, and that equates to about a 73% reduction in inventory that we had last January 2012 when we had 1,037 homes on the market. Now, 212 of the homes that we do have available uh, represent about 77%. These are standard sellers. Standard sellers have all been showing up more and more frequently every month. I mean, are these, these percentages will tell you that 77% of the homes are equity sellers or standard sales. 38 homes or 14% being short pay. I mean, a year ago, we were at 46% short sale. Now we're at only 14%. What does that tell you? It tells you that banks have been working more towards loan modifications, keeping people in their home, and certainly not foreclosing. So if the bank's not been pushing for the foreclosure, then fewer homeowners are actually saying, well, I better get myself together here and get my home on the market. So we've only got 14% of the market being a short sale. Uh, 23 homes, or only 8%, is the bank-owned inventory. I mean, 23 bank-owned properties, that's not even worth mentioning. Uh, but certainly, uh, it, you know, you have to mention it because it is what it is. Again, like I've said, month after month, we, you, if you were watching the news, you would probably even think that, you know, we have 60% foreclosure. It's 8% right here in Santa Clarita. We fare much better than some other areas of Southern California. It's a very desirable community. Um, I started to touch on this a little bit. We've sold 283 homes. Those were closed escrows in the last 30 days right here in SCV. And uh, you know we were on pace for about the number of homes that had sold in a year as it averages out month over month was about 312, 314. Uh, so again, this is the, the third month in a row that we've kind of come below that number. Um, with all of that said, uh, interest rates are still fantastic. Home buyers are definitely out there and interested. If you're looking for a great opportunity, get in touch with us. You need to be aggressive. Uh, watch my video blog from a month or two ago where I talked about some of the things you might be expected to do. It's a tough market out there as a home buyer, but uh, there is hope if you put the right plan together and work with the right team. 
a local real estate professional such as ourselves. Uh, you know, if you're an investor, this is certainly still another great time to do that. Um, a large book of our clients are investor clients now, uh, buying these properties with cash. So home buyers, first time buyers, you're out there competing with some of these investors as well. So, uh, you know, long story short, get in touch with us, excuse me, get in touch with us if you need help. Uh, we're more than happy to answer any and all of your questions. Let's have a sit down, kind of highlight some of what's happening with the market, define your goals and your objectives, and then let us show you how we can sort of put a plan together that's gonna be in line with meeting your goals. Uh, once again, I just wanna thank you guys for taking the time to tune in to my monthly video blog. I really do appreciate every one of you. And uh, if you need any help, just look us up on the web, uh, www.choosebrian.com. You can just give us a buzz at the number you see right up here on the screen, 661-373-9714. Uh, from Carolyn, Ryan, Kristen, and myself, we thank you very much. And remember, the opportunities are everywhere if you just know where to look. And nowadays, more than ever, the right agent and the right team matters. Thanks a lot, you guys. We'll talk to you soon. Take care.